<laughs> we all just wanted to know what had happened to you on the break. Well, this may come as a shock to some of you guys, but after about a year of uh, being single, I am now dating. Good for you. <laughs> With that being said, while I was on vacation in Mexico, uh, Paparazzi took some photos of me and the guy that I'm dating. His name is Israel Houghton. <laughs> and I, I think, you know, it is important to clarify something. So I know a lot of blogs went crazy, but that's why I'm here to set the record straight. Mm -hmm. So this man pictured here is not married. How about that? Praise God. <laughs> first things first. First things first, I think it's important to clarify things because people can put up headlines and you run away with that and no one actually reads sometimes the articles or uh, somehow they miss big public announcements. Or they that just be talking about stuff they don't know nothing don't know. about. How about that? Yeah. That, that too. Okay, what happened now? Okay, what happened? So, so with that being said, he had actually put out a statement. He, uh, ha he is single, number one. And I think the other thing people were saying was that I was the cause of his divorce. Mm -hmm. Which I think any divorce is obviously a sad thing. People have to go through. It takes time to get through that sort of thing. And I think... No one put that time together. I think you see an announcement made, you know, at the top of this year, and then you see these photos, and you say to yourself, well, let's put this together, but this is why I'm grateful for moments like this, because it allows you to set the facts straight. And God forbid the facts get in the way of a really good, juicy story. Right. Yeah. I'm going to say the truth, and the truth of the matter is that isn't the case. He, he obviously is divorced. He had put out a statement saying that um, he had failed in his marriage, and it was about five years back. I didn't know him at that time. So to put that blame on me was mm -hmm. obviously hurtful. I think, you know, I love unfair. that you guys reached out. It was unfair. Um, as two single people, we were friends for two and a half years from doing promo and stuff like that. Another clarification, he was not besties with Lenny, who I also got a great phone call from, who was like, I pray that you are not on those blogs, Adrian. Don't you allow... Your ex-fiance. My ex-fiance uh, gave me a call. He's a great guy. And I think... Um, just hearing that phone call and somebody reaching out and saying, hey, I'm calling to make sure you're okay because I know who you are. Mm -hmm. These people don't know who you are. Don't allow them to, to, define, to you. define you. Don't allow these blogs to even upset you. That's I got a right. call from Tamar that pretty much said, Adrian, if you are not having a margarita in Mexico, I'm coming over there to slap you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because at the end of the day, even, I mean, I feel like you did this for you, but you don't, you don't deserve you don't have to explain your life to right. anybody, right. you know? I love you. I know you. You're a great woman. I know Israel. I love Israel. He's a great guy and yeah. a great dad. And, you know, you guys don't have to explain your relationship to anybody, you know? You guys know what you have. It's something special. It's something magical. We're married. We can see when you got something real. Yeah. And it's something real. <laughs> and, you know, you don't owe this explanation to anybody. So I just want you to know, you don't have to vindicate yourself. You're a wonderful woman, a good woman, and God bless you guys. Thank you so it's much. It's hard out here trying to find love, child, yeah, so get your yeah, life. Yeah, you think, yeah, 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 it's all hard. He's a great guy, and I'm, I'm really happy, but I'm glad we were able to set that straight. I felt like I was going to have to be Marsha Clark. I'm obsessed with the O.J. Simpson trial. <laughs> I was going to be like, Exhibit A! <laughs> <laughs> You're right. It doesn't need explanation. I know the truth, and I think um, when you have friends and loved ones that know your truth, and you know that... Um, God defines who I am. How about That's that? Right. You know what I mean? I think God knows my heart. Period. God yeah. knows the situation, and Period. I think that I can rest in that. And Absolutely. I want to say something. They're married. Yeah. So there, it's a different lifestyle when you're married versus when you're dating. Very different. Oh, yeah. And that's the reason why some people express what they do on the show because they're married, and they know that they, they have their definite partners. We don't yeah. know what we going to happen. What's yeah, you don't jump out the gate and you know start me. dating exactly. somebody and go make announcements. You, exactly. You let things build up. You find out where it's going. Going, you, yeah, because you don't want to look like a hoe in these streets. You no, know? Exactly. You exactly. That's that's right. You told everybody about them. And yeah, they, yeah, that's 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 you cute. spend quality time with to get to know with, you don't go and make that sort of no, a exactly. and let these things take time. Exactly. Yeah, that's honestly, that's Adrian, right. Adrian, that's your business. How about yes, that? It yeah. It's right. your business and no one else. But you know, everybody wants to make assumptions. I, and it was, I just hate that you had to go through that because we it know hurt. that you're a good girl. It shouldn't have. Did you, you ain't drink enough. That's the problem. <laughs> <laughs> I did not. I did you not. Should. <laughs> well, you guys, <laughs> I love you guys so much. Thank you, you thank you, thank you. We love well, you. We're here for you guys. Anyway, yeah. This one had me in tears in D.C. <laughs> Because, you know, I think people, you guys know me. I know I you. It just makes a difference. So thank you to you guys that sent us love and blessings, and we'll see what happens.